This video is intended to aid the train service technician in repairing this particular Alto Sham oven. Do not attempt to repair this oven if you are not a trained service technician. Service technicians may obtain the proper training by contacting the Alto Sham technical service team. When repairing this oven, wear personal protective equipment and follow local codes and regulations. Contact the Alto Sham technical service team if you have any questions about how to safely and properly repair this appliance. The purpose of this video is to explain how to install the plumbing kit for the Alto Sham Converge ovens. In this video, we will demonstrate the CPVC install, but the copper installation process is similar. To perform this installation, you will need a plumbing kit, various hand tools, a number 30 drill bit, thread sealant, lead-free solder, a pipe cutter, a torch, a CPVC cutter, and CPVC glue. The solder, pipe cutter, and torch are not shown, but are required for the copper plumbing installation. First, make sure the electrical cord is unplugged and the main disconnect switch is in the off position. Install lockout tagout equipment in accordance with local building codes and regulations. Next, remove the two adapter fittings on the water inlets. Apply thread sealant to the threads of the adapter fittings. Install the street elbow from the plumbing kit onto the adapter fittings. Install the adapter fittings and elbows onto the water inlets with slip joint pliers. Don't over tighten the elbows or you'll risk breaking the rubber gaskets. Tighten the fittings until the elbows have a slight downward angle, shown here. Install the water hoses onto the elbows. Install the vent pipe support bracket onto the fan cover. Measure and mark two lines, shown here. Make a hole at the intersection of the two lines. Use a number 30 drill bit and drill a hole for the mounting bracket. Install the mounting bracket. Drill a hole for the second mounting bracket screw and install the screw. Measure and cut a short piece of drain pipe. Install the pipe into the T-fitting from the kit. Then, install the pipe and T-fitting into the no-hub coupling. The coupling should sit far enough out of the oven so that the vent pipe sits plumb or straight up and down. Measure and cut a vent pipe for the rear drain. The drain pipe must sit above the exhaust vents. Install the vent pipe through the support bracket and then into the T-fitting. The vent pipe must be higher than the oven exhaust pipe. Press and reset the high limit switches after the install is complete to make sure they're not tripped. A three chamber converge has three and a two chamber has two. If this were a two chamber, there would only be one high limit switch found here. Cut and install the drain pipe from the funnel to the floor drain. Use support where needed. This install is not specific and may not mirror yours. Make sure to follow local plumbing codes and regulations. When looking at the rear of the oven, the left side is for untreated water and the right side is for treated water. This water line adapter is optional. Make sure the lines use the correct thread connections. Install the water line adapter from the plumbing kit onto your water supply and install the water supply hose. Repeat the installation for the second hose. Once your hoses are installed, turn on the water and check for leaks. Cut and install a lower drain pipe into the T-fitting if required to reach the funnel drain behind the oven. The plumbing installation for the Converge oven is now complete. For more videos, please visit our website.